Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. In this video, I am going to show you very easy and quick tutorial about how to unlock the bootloader of OnePlus 7 Pro. This method almost works in all OnePlus models. However, I have selected OnePlus 7 Pro to unlock the bootloader. Bootloader unlock is very necessary if you want to root your mobile or if you want to flash custom recovery like TWRP or if you want to install custom firmware. Keep in mind, unlocking bootloader will wipe all your data. So back up your important data before proceed. So without making any delay, let's get started. Here, I have OnePlus 7 Pro mobile having a Snapdragon processor 855. For unlock the bootloader, first we need to activate developer option. For that, we need to go to setting, about phone, then we have to click build option 5-6 time. Then it will activate the developer option, then we have to go back and click on system, there is developer option. So now we have to turn on OEM unlocking, so we have to enable it, then we have to turn on advanced reboot. And the last thing, we need to turn on USB debugging then click OK. Next step is download some required file in order to unlock bootloader which is tool all in one. We can use this tool in various function like flash custom recovery, routing, unlocking bootloader and many more. This app is very handy so you don't have to worry about typing and remembering different type of command while unlocking bootloader or rooting the device. In this page, the download resource link is provided, so you can click any of them in order to download the file. Always download the latest file provided by the developers. Another file we need is OEM USB driver, which is also very essential to make communication between PC to Android phone. So for OnePlus device, we need to use MTK Android USB driver. Here I have both zip file which are tool all in one and OEM USB driver. So now we have to extract both file to our PC. Now, next step is open tool all in one, then right click setup.exe and then run as administrator, then click S, yes, then click on install. It will auto launch the app, if not, we have to manually launch the application. Now, connect the OnePlus device to PC via original OnePlus cable. It will ask to allow USB debugging with computer RSA key fingerprint. We have to allow it to make communication between Android device to PC. You can see in tool all-in-one interface, device status is showing ADB unauthorized. So click on check to show ADB devices. There is unlock option on that interface, click on that. It will ask branded device or normal device. Branded means device purchased from the store or device sold by T-Mobile. And normal device means purchased from online stores like Amazon. I had purchased this device from the Amazon so it is normal device. So that I have to click on normal device. Then click on yes your device will reboot and boot to the bootloader you can see at the device it is showing locked it means it is not getting bootloader unlocking option this is why 
because OEM USB driver is not installed. Go for installation of OEM USB. Go to my PC, right click, manage, then device manager. Here, in other device it is showing Android with some issue sign because of the driver is not installed. In order to install the driver, right click on Android, update driver, browse my computer, let me pick from a list, then click on next. And then select Android device, then next, have disk, browse, and browse the location where you kept the MTK Android USB driver, then select Android winusb.inf file then click on open and ok then select android bootloader interface click on yes now you can see windows has successfully updated the driver also in oneplus 7 pro screen you can see it is showing unlocking option you can use volume down and up key to move for the selection select the unlock the bootloader option then click power button to select and proceed. You can see in the screen it is showing bootloader is unlocked so wait till device wipe your data and boot up. It may take 4 to 5 minutes to boot the device and then you have to configure your device. To check the bootloader has unlocked or not, you have to go to setting, about phone, click the build number 5-6 time to activate the developer option, then go back to system, developer option, here you can see OEM unlocking is turned on and it don't have turn off option, it means you have successfully unlocked the bootloader. Now you can enjoy rooting your device, installing custom recovery, flashing different type of custom ROM, installing Expose framework and many more. When you restart your device, every first boot there will some warning message will appear. So ignore this message. Thanks for watching. If you like my work, please don't forget to like, share and subscribe. Also don't forget to watch other tech related video of my channel.